last year in Japan. Before we continue, please don't forget to subscribe here for more upcoming videos. Thank you! I bought this figure last year in Japan before I came back in Philippines who worth 650 Japanese yen. Same with my Tanjiro figure, but I was surprised in the box it's 3,300 yen. I already explained the reason last week while I'm doing an unboxing for Tajiro Kamado figure but for those who haven't watched yet, it's because it's a Black Friday sale. I bought them in an anime store in Japan. What name of the store is Hiroshima. Are you also familiar in this store too? Well, I made a shorter vlog last year in my YouTube channel so you may visit my channel Rochelle Diary then go to my playlist and click the shopping in Japan. All vlogs related to my groceries and shopping are uploaded here. So okay, let's go back to my unboxing. Oh, same with my Tanjiro, they had a unique shape for the supporting box inside to protect the figure. Senetsu Akatsuma no the stopper figure made by SEGA. These are mostly seen in any gaming machine in Japan. You can also buy in any online shop like Amazon or you may visit some anime store not only in Japan but in any store selling anime stuff near you. Same what I did. This figure looks so very cool. Same with my Tanjiro figure. The size is kinda big unlike the Michael Jusatoro no the Stopper figure but the difference in this figure than Tanjiro, his payroll or Chuntaro that frequently seen perched on the top of Senetsu head in the anime are also included here and it's really cute, very tiny and de very detailed and it's so easy to put and attach in, head, in his head too. For the short review guys, Senetsu face are very happy. I thought he is shy while eating the rice ball but after looking in his eyes and his eyebrows, I tried to search in Google for his facial expression and I found out that she is very happy. Same with Tanjiro and the others. The hair are very detailed and bright because of his unique hair color, yellow and orange. The body uniform and his Howry jacket are also detailed and yeah very nice flat on the bottom side here and then we also have a little bit of information there where it says produced in China same in my Tajiro figure last week but most of these figures are made in China for the cost purposes but overall it's pretty cool and very detailed that's why I like it 
and that's all for today guys i forgot to say for if you want if you are interested to watch more anime unboxing you may visit my channel rochelle diary go to my playlist and click popular anime in japan all blogs related to anime that i made last year and this year are uploaded here so that's all for today thank you for watching and see you for my next unboxing video bye bye Thanks for watching! Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you!